how many dreams have I done so far? Um, well, let's see. That was number six just now. So we're moving on to number seven. Okay, so next person who we're gonna visit uh, goes by the name Mr. Mooster. Um, let's see what they have in store for us, shall we? I don't know if I recognize the username off the top of my head, so it might be a lurker, it might be for someone from YouTube. Um, do. There you go. Which number you do? Oh, I'm not even sure yet, right? Or I have to, um, I have to split them up into the two dreams per episode. So I'm not quite sure yet. Got Renka in your home. Nice. Congratulations. Okay, so this is Honeycrisp, which is a really cute island name, I think. Um, and already I'm kind of liking the vibes I'm getting here. Let's take a look. Okay, so we have Aurora. Uh, that's Hazel, Bricolo, Audie, Midge, Kid, Flora, Ingus? Yep, Yuka and Diana. Hey, Shumblet, welcome back. Since apples. <laughs> Pokemon Fanatic, hello, how are you doing today? It's a really cute town flag. Um, over this way. I just, I see these little, like, ooh, the variant of the path. Um, I see these little walkways here and I'm instantly curious. Got some wind turbines up there. Lots of apples down here. <laughs> nice little sitting area. I really like these. I something about these bushes with this fence looks really good. I don't actually ever use that fence in I named my town so far at least. Um, but they look really good there. Ah, oh, Pokemon Fag. I'm actually not sure. I'm actually not sure. I I don't remember. Not today at least, I don't think. Oh, you got some money trees. <laughs> nice little entrance to your town over here. Um, let's see. So you have your shopping here. Which is looking pretty good. And then down here you have, like, a little bit of an outside market. And of course the Able Sisters right next to it. Guys, I have a question, by the way. Just, like, question of the day. If you could port one game to the Switch, and I mean just a port. Not an HD remaster, nothing like that. Just a straight up port. One port. One game to put on the Switch, what would you choose? Skyward Sword. <laughs> uh, is it Quentin Smith? Hello, how's it going? Welcome on in here. Little coffee shop right next door. Oh, Pepper, I'm sorry about that. Picnic area right here. This is very cute. The two wide paths remind me of New Leaf a lot, though, I think. We just mentioned one and two is a bundle. Kirby Air Ride. Oh, I love that game. <laughs> Crisis. Fancy life. Yes. <laughs> we sports are our Animal Crossing City folk. I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. I'm a little bit under the weather today, but otherwise I'm, I'm doing okay. Very cute. I like how they have this laid out. It seems very natural. This little DIY section over here. Thank you so much for the follow. Well, come on in. All the Mario parties with online multi. You guys are cheating by saying all of them. <laughs> but I accept it. I accept it. Sometimes it's hard to choose. Wind Waker. Mario Galaxy 2. Hey, Tiki Toucans. 
I'm I'm loving the loving the love, I guess, for fantasy life. That game is fantastic and it needs more appreciation. Detroit Become Human or Last of Us. Very nice. Oh, this is really, really pretty. Very nice garden set up. Pepper, I know of it, but I've never played it. Okay, I'm just going to sneak up here, just in case there's something I haven't seen. Violet Princess. Oh, and Yuka's up here too. Still haven't forgiven you. <laughs> she was so mean to us. Yeah, stretcher. Oh, there's like a little farm up there. A little sneak peek of what we're about to go see. This is really, really nice here. Oh, Professor Layton. Interesting choice. Um... Okay, so this is like a little farm area here. This is really nicely done. I like these uh, these designs. These work really well. Orange and purple rose combo. Yeah, that looked good. It's uh, very Halloween colors for me, at least. It'll never happen, but Sims 3. <laughs> yeah, the Sims 3 needs a bit more, a bit more attention. You got like a very nice, uh, very scenic campsite up here. You get a nice view of all over the island. Oh, and then you have your rocks all arranged up here. That's really well done. Good job. I'm, I have so much um, respect for people who take the time to get their rocks in a certain place. I could never do it. Too much work. <laughs> sitting area and your reds beach is really far to the left that's really interesting what rank do you get on your home i think i usually get s ranks in this town i don't really change anything with my home though why do the apples there remind you of fall guys i mean one of the patterns you can have in game is like stripes so maybe i don't know This looks a little bit unfinished, and that's totally fine. Or the fruit matching round. Yeah, that could be it. Five hours to do your rock garden. Oh, goodness. <laughs> there you go. Nice little orchard. And then this would go back downstairs, but we don't want to go down there just yet. I'm curious who this villager is up here, because one, they're right next to your house, and two, they have their own spot. Rocolo, interesting. I wonder if he's a favorite, maybe? I do, I do. We played it on Friday. We're probably going to play a little bit more today, actually. Be nice to Hazel. <laughs> okay. I haven't seen her yet, but... really want Fall Guys to come to Switch. I'm a little bit surprised that hasn't been announced yet, to be honest. Hopefully soon, though. Oh, I like this. Very bright, very welcoming. Lots of yellow and green. Oh, you got like a bit of a collection room back here. You have a fortune turtle pet, maybe? <laughs> this is very nice. Feels very summery in here. I think it's this furniture, though. I like this. I wish I had this sort of tub right now. <laughs> that looks super relaxing. Um, 
But to answer my own question, I don't know if I'd choose Animal Crossing GameCube or if I'd choose Harvest Moon A Wonderful Life, which was also on the GameCube. Um, to be ported to Switch. I really like both of them. They're both very, very iconic for me. I feel like I'm in Andy's room. <laughs> I do like the, uh, the general idea of this room, though. Hey, Kim, welcome back from your lurk. Oh, I like this. So you have like a little bit of an office meeting area. And then you got your bedroom over here. Very nice. That looks cozy. I like the water cooler as well. Oh, it's my weakness. Aha! I won. <laughs> I feel like I saw a lot of those last Sunday and I don't- I didn't see any really today until now, obviously. Um, but yeah, those things are uh, a bit of a weakness. <laughs> there we go. I really like your outfit. Um... So I haven't seen... Did I see the museum yet? I don't think I have. Let's go meander our way over that way. That has a really, really interesting layout to it though. Just very open. Reminds me a lot of the older Animal Crossing games. Oh, this is really nice. You have like a little picnic area for outside. You got some displays going on. That looks like the, um, the creature from Super Mario 64 <laughs> that I was scared of the other day. Oh yeah, Triforce Master, what were you up to? Hey Dylan, welcome back. This is a very nice area. Now one thing, I just want to make sure, because I think I went around this. Um, no, not that one. Did I go around it? Wait a minute. Wait a minute, your girl's confused. Also... There we go. <laughs> this area. I just wanted to make sure I saw this, because I thought the, the double waterfall was kind of a neat little little thing to do here. Awesome, awesome. What a pretty town. Um, so if I want to go back, I want to go back this way, I think. <laughs> I think it's the lack of paths, but I'm- I was having a little bit of trouble navigating in here. There we go, and we're back. <laughs> Pretty town. I like this one. I like the- it's very, very- it almost feels like hands-off. You don't feel like someone's been, you know, excruciating over like every single little detail sort of thing. Um, and that's awesome. That's awesome. It looks really good. You could get that love in chat, please and thank you. Well, Dylan, we appreciate you being here. Uh, thank you so much for the follow. Do you ever feel like people get mad if you don't use a webcam? I'd love to stream one day. Oh, sorry, my phone went off, uh, but I don't want to use one. I'd say stream, regardless, webcam or no. I sometimes have my camera on, I sometimes don't. Um, and it's been really, really nice for me to realize I don't always need to have my camera on to stream. Um, so I'd say do it, just enjoy yourself. Um, if people are mad, there's no reason for them to be. It doesn't really matter either way. You're still here, you're still playing. <laughs> Ryder, I think it just looks nice, to be honest. <laughs> I've had a couple of people get kind of weird about me not having 
my cam on and they'll be like, oh, where's your camera? But like, most of the time it's just people coming in being like, oh, I see you're not on camera today. Okay. Yeah, I did. I did. Um, the chat was custom made for me, but the rest of it was, was just me tinkering around and making something. <laughs> um, okay, so next up, we have... Uh, someone who's going by the name The Brighter Side of Things. Um, with their town of Newbark. Let's see what they have. Phone, please. <laughs> I'm assuming that's probably, uh, Pokemon Go still. Unless it's Mike. Thank you so much for the follow! Welcome on in! Oh, Shambla, I'm glad that she, uh, she didn't mind it. Whenever I hear someone talk, I love hearing their accent everywhere. It's so different and it fascinates me. It is! It is very interesting. Oh! oh. <laughs> Suddenly. Brick. <laughs> is that a Q-bone post? Or, uh, ooh. Flag? As if so, that's adorable. Also, we... Ooh, this map. We are having some lag. <laughs> um, fair warning, it's not your stream. It's it's my Switch trying to keep up with this island. Uh, we play a lot of Animal Crossing here, but I've been kind of doing a lot of other stuff recently. I call myself Variety. We, we do a lot of Nintendo, I guess. Sorry, Night. Thank you. Okay. Oh, this is confusing. Merchant, 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 merchant. Oh, you're not a merchant. Rendo? <laughs> uh, so we have Anka, Kyle, Zell, Coco, Avery, Chief, uh, Savannah, Phoebe, Lucky, and Clay. <laughs> Sorry, random. This is gonna be confusing. Um, oh god, okay. Things might lag a bit. So fair warning. <laughs> oh goodness me. Okay, so you have some stuff in here. You, you, if I wanted to get around. Oh wait, no, not that. Don't take that. Put that down. Um, vaulting pole. Is this the ladder? No. Okay. Well, at least I have a vaulting pole in a town that doesn't really have any rivers. Never mind. <laughs> Weird. This is so much. Hi, Coco. This is kind of a cool idea, though. Like a full out desert town. Oh, God. Items are like popping in as I run. Oh, the lag. <laughs> hey, Confused. Welcome back. This is so intricate. I know I said this before, but whenever I see a town like this that lags as bad, I always assume the person doesn't actually play in it anymore because it just feels painful to... to even think about. <laughs> what game do you like there? New Horizons or New Leaf? I don't think you can compare them, to be honest. I think that they're two so, so different games. They're both good in their own way. <laughs> well, uh, x -Men, welcome back. Do you have stuff in your tents, actually? I just suddenly realized, but do you have more stuff to sell in your tents? Oh, you do! That's kind of cool. That's very detailed. I don't know if I'm going to go into each and every single one of these, because the loading will take forever. But, I like the idea of that. How is it lagging on the beach? Oh my god. Oh, jeez. Usually it gets better if you get away from like the center of town, but this just this just is. Oh my gosh, I I know 
I've seen only other one other town that has fully been paved over, and that's randoms. Um, so it's kind of cool to see it again. <laughs> this is really, really neat. This is such a cool concept. And then you have your, your villagers up here. Yeah, I like the idea of this town. Oh, there we go. That's a little bit better. That's not laggy. It's a very, very cool concept. I'm excited to see what else they have because the map obviously doesn't tell you. Um, what everything is or where everything is, so. X-Men, be careful with the caps, my friend. I think Strawcherry just told you, but the bot... The bot can Oh, I thought we were at the ocean. Oh, that was so confusing. Oh my god, wait. <laughs> I was like, wait, what? We're not at the ocean yet. <laughs> um, the bot can get a little bit funny about caps. That's a neat idea. I honestly thought that we were at the ocean and that it suddenly was hacked or something. Oh, and then you got, like, your fabrics up here. Oh my god, there's so much. No wonder it lags. Oh, wow. No worries, it's okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's go back down around the other way. Oh! The lag, Luna, the lag. <laughs> you seen pics of this online? It's really cool. And then is this just all desert? Is it like all open? Oh wait, there's like a, a hot spring or bathhouse here. Simple panels are bad for lagging out islands, I can imagine. I don't know if I can actually get over there from this way. I think I have to go the other way. <laughs> yeah, I think most of the map is sand. Um, but I'm- I'm gonna explore it, because I think that there might be some stuff here. Yeah, this is cool. And then you've got, you've got like an oasis here. That's very, very cool. Oh, well, that's kind of dark. He's fine, I swear. He's just- he's enjoying a sand bath. Ooh! Ooh, wait! Oh, this is kind of sketchy looking. I like it. That's cool. That's really, really well done. This place looks so fancy. I know, imagine laying down each and every tile of sand in this case. I guess it's dirt in Random's case as well. Okay, so this is all empty here. Just want to make sure. Usually I don't run, but of course they're, they're very open. <laughs> I want to go see the pyramids. There they are. That was so deceiving when I first saw it. <laughs> it's a massive pain, yeah. This is so weird. It's, just, it's weird to see. <laughs> okay, nothing down here just yet. Well, Fudge, I hope you enjoy your, um, enjoy your sub, and also thank you so much for the follow, by the way. This is me. I want to go back, um, into the lag. <laughs> and I want to go if we can see the, uh, see if we can see the, the bathhouse looking area. Wait, have I gone in the wrong way? I think I did. Entered this island on Heartwatch. You're so beautiful. I'm glad I figured out where I'd seen the island before. Oh, well, there you go. Wait, how do I get back in? Oh, God. Have I locked myself out forever? No, I think we're good. <laughs> you can actually see the frame riches. You can. You most certainly can. Oh, boy. <laughs> Here we go. And then you got your, your shopping up here. <laughs> I love all the palm trees as well. It just 
And like choosing the terracotta stone for this. There's your museum. All right, Kawaii Trooper, enjoy your dinner. Enjoy your dinner. Thank you so much for everything once again. Oh, hi. Jeez. <laughs> I've missed some houses here too, so I have to go back and see those. <laughs> Random. This is really, really neat. Looks so relaxing. Oh, I was hoping I could hop over. Um, let's go and see these houses. Cause I'm, I, I see lots of tents and I'm assuming they all have like merchant stuff in them, which is neat. But I do want to know about the bigger houses here. Um, I just have to figure out how to get there. <laughs> I think I ran past it earlier. Okay, wait. Oh, this way. Okay, freedom! Back to normal frame rate. <laughs> this is what I missed earlier. Oh, I can't get there from this way. Okay, I have to go all the way back in. <laughs> this kind of, and this is very, very specific, but it reminds me of playing Kingdom Hearts 1 for the first time and exploring Agrabah, so the um, Aladdin-themed town, and getting lost in that, because it's it's meant to be very, very confusing, meant to be very topsy-turvy. And... I think this is the way. Hi! That's so cool. Oh, wait. So trait. How do you I can't do topsy turvy right now. I don't have my cam on. Do it in sixty-four. Do you wanna give those back and ask for it again? Ooh, tomorrow maybe? Who's my favorite Pokemon? I really like Cyndaquil. Oh, I can flip the stream itself if you want, but just, yeah, I can do it for 64, not, not for this. This is so fancy. Oh my goodness. Oh, and you got like your magic carpet ride, maybe? <laughs> Galactic Firefly, thank you! I hope you enjoy. Yeah, Pepper, if you could. Well, yeah, you know what, Stratra, you can redeem it again later, I think? If you want to, just in case. Eric, thank you so much for the follow. Got like a tomb downstairs. This is very cool. It's fine? Okay. This is such a neat concept for a house and for a town in general. Like, I guarantee I have not stepped across or come across anything remotely similar to this before. Oh, oh, there you go. Watching on YouTube for months. Thank you so much for watching there. And thank you for coming over to Twitch as well. I hope you enjoy it. Oh, okay. I'm not allowed in here. Fair. Okay, nothing up here. That's fine. <laughs> this is such a crazy island. I wish it didn't lag so bad, but I understand why, especially with all those. Um... What a weird place! I love it though! I like the idea, I like the, the uniqueness of it. Um... I think I've seen everything. Peace. Can we get some love in chat, you guys? <laughs> I'll be happy to stop lagging, but I also really like the idea here.